What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I have some news for you that's going to absolutely rock your world. So it was up late night per usual, just scrolling through my computer and I saw an ad pop up for live fish for sale on ebay.com. Now eBay is known for selling antiques, shoes, all kinds of crazy knickknacks, but it is definitely not known for selling live fish. I've never even heard of somebody buying a live fish from eBay, so this might even be a scam. I'm not sure, but I want to take you along the journey today of me buying a bunch of awesome and really cool expensive fish from eBay. I'm gonna go on my computer right now and we're gonna look at a bunch of the awesome fish that they have for sale on the website. So look how crazy this is. All I have to do is type in live fish in the search bar up here. Look what pops up, boom, live fish in aquariums. And look at all these options. We have a discus right here, a bunch of plants, koi. They even have a piranha on here. How does eBay have piranha for sale on it? Long nose gar? So they even have like exotic fish on here. They literally have all kinds of stuff. Even look at these betas on here. That would be so sick to buy an insane beta fish off eBay. I don't know if you all knew this or not, but like for some reason, I just feel like I'm out of the loop. Like I'm, I'm shocked that eBay has this kind of selection. I guess it's different sellers and you can either buy it or bid on it, but like this is crazy. So I've been on here for about an hour now looking at all the fish and I just found something that's gonna absolutely blow your mind. I'm in the saltwater fish section and look at what I just found. This is one of the most highly sought after fish in the entire world. This right here, is the holy grail of saltwater fish. This is a gem tang. Check this out. These things normally go for like $1,000. The starting bid is at $500. So it literally can go up to like over $1,000. Also, I haven't even showed you all this yet. This is my 13 gallon saltwater tank that houses a fish that will get over 600 pounds. I can't wait to show you him in the future. He's hiding back there right now, but he's gonna be a beast and we'll need a tank upgrade very, very soon. So stay tuned for that video in the next month or so. So guys, I've spent the last hour or so on eBay looking at all the fish that I have, and here's what I wanna do. I wanna go in here and order an insane box of fish for you guys and unbox it tomorrow when it gets delivered here at my doorstep. Now I'm probably gonna spend like $500, so if you could, please drop a like on this video, subscribe, it would really mean a lot to me, and I'm gonna pick up the camera tomorrow when the box gets here. All right, guys, the fish just showed up. Let's go get the box and let's see what we got. Oh yeah, baby. Look at this box, baby. We got some good stuff in here. Ah, Live fish from eBay. Let's go open this sucker up. I wanna show you all what I got, cause it's pretty insane. I've been waiting all day to finally open this box. We spent $500 and there's a bunch of awesome fish in here. We're in the makeshift warehouse behind me. Before we open this box up, let me know right now, did you actually know that you could buy live fish on eBay? I didn't know, pretty crazy. But yeah, you can go on there and get the fish shipped next day to your house, just like you're ordering from a fish store, which is pretty wild to me, but you all should try it sometime. Also, I wanna let y'all know that these are not no average fish. This is some real G stuff in here. This is insane, $500 for this box. Oh yeah. Now we got three bags in here. All right, first fish coming out right here. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, you're gonna love that. Check that out. That is a gulper catfish. This is the baddest catfish on the planet. This fish can take down a fish almost double its size. It is the craziest thing. We're gonna get the coolest eating videos with this guy. He's a big fat boy too. Looks like he's been eating Taco Bell for like a month before I got him. Now this is gonna be a sick addition to the fish warehouse. He cannot live with anything else but his own species because he will kill and destroy it. I'll get a feeding video for you guys very, very soon. So we're gonna go ahead and throw this guy in the tank and get him acclimated. Now, we still have two more fish in here that are also really rare. And hey, y'all are gonna love this next one. This is, I've wanted one of these for a very long time. My last one got eaten by my baby short body catfish, which is right here. This is Chubbs, and he is an absolute menace. Say what's up to Chubbs. All right, so Chubbs ate my last one, and so now what I did is I went out and got an even bigger one. Check this out. This is the largest freshwater puffer on Earth. Look at that sucker. And they'll get at least a foot and a half to two feet long. This guy is gonna be a beast and eventually he'll probably have his own tank at the warehouse. It's gonna be like a 400 gallon tank and we can feed him all kinds of awesome crayfish, shellfish because they have teeth like a bird's beak. So I wanna show you all something really cool actually with this fish. As you all know, it's a puffer fish and I'm gonna show you the reason why they call it a puffer fish. I'm gonna shake this bag and get it to puff up for you guys and y'all gonna be wild. All right, ready? Just kidding. Don't do that ever if you have a puffer fish, guys. It can kill them. You do not want them to puff up. They only puff up when they're stressed. We wanna be very careful when acclimating this fish. Follow me. We're gonna put him in here with the shark army. And he's gonna acclimate nice in there. Oh, there's that puffer right there, baby. Golly, that thing is a beauty. 
Wait till that thing gets bigger too. The colors on that thing will be absolutely insane. Now we gotta be really careful with him because he could probably kill most fish in one bite. He has this beak right here. I don't know if you can see it very well, but he kind of hides it in there. He's got that little, little beak. And I mean, I'm telling you guys, if you get bit by that thing, it would probably take a chunk out of your finger and you have to get stitches. So we want to be very careful with that puffer fish. And for the last fish in this insane box from eBay, drum roll please. We had another gulper catfish. This might not look like the prettiest fish ever. This thing is a menace. So now we have a male and a female of these. I'm going to add this in the tank now and get them acclimated. Trust me, when we feed these guys, you're going to be blown away. This fish, if it's this big, it can eat a fish that big. I don't know how. It's pretty wild. So with that being said, guys, we're going to get these acclimated for the next 30 minutes or so. We're going to cut them open, and then you're going to see a close-up look of the awesome fish we got today from eBay. All right, so the fish are done acclimating now. We need to cut their bags open and get them prepped to go in their tank. Look at that fish, dude. Look at the mouth on that thing. Whoa, okay. Right into the tank he goes. I'm gonna show you all a quick and easy way of how to get your fish in the tank without getting all the tank water in there because that water is disgusting. Look at that monster. Oh, uh oh. He's getting all wrapped up in the net. Uh oh, he's all wrapped up in the net. Come on, little buddy, get out of there. Check that out, dude, that is so sick. These have to be two of the ugliest fish I've ever seen in my entire life. But in exchange for that, they're also one of the coolest fish when it comes to eating. I promise you when we put this giant goldfish in there, they will crush them. They're gonna get to know each other for a little while. So now we need to go add the MDU in the tank and get that boy acclimated. Now it's time for Mrs. Puff to go in her tank. Crack her open. She's gonna be the tank boss of the 75 gallon, believe it or not. They kind of have an attitude when needed. This is really crucial we don't get her to puff up. Hopefully she doesn't puff up. Come on, little baby. Come on, Mrs. Puff. All right, she's in there right now. Nice and easy. Watch this release. Mrs. Puff, dude, that is so fire. She looks amazing. I can't believe we got this fish from eBay. Now that we have all the fish in their tanks, we're gonna leave them alone for the next couple of days because we don't wanna stress them out. We wanna leave them alone in a nice dark tank and let them settle in. I can't wait to get them over the warehouse very, very soon. The 8,000 gallon pond is almost done, I promise you guys. I cannot wait to show you all. It's gonna blow your all's mind. I still can't believe these fish came in as good as they did. I'm absolutely blown away by the quality and the packing of these fish. Guys, if you wanna try this for yourself, I highly suggest doing so. Also, don't forget to enter the $50 giveaway, guys. It is totally free. All you have to do is like, comment, be subscribed to the channel, and watch the entire video, and you're literally entered to win free money, and you can enter every single week, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.